Hello guys, my name is The Old Mechanic and welcome back in my shed. Today I'm gonna tell you a few things about a quick shifter. I'm still busy on my son his S1000R and his quick shifter stopped working. So I took the uh, quick shifter off the bike and did some measurements on it. I had no idea what was inside of the quick shifter. So eventually we tried a lot. We found that there was uh, one cable that was broken. We soldered it again. We, we adjust everything and then he took it for a ride but it wasn't it still wasn't working so he ordered another one a good a good one and it turns out guys those bmw quick shifters on a, a s1000 rr s1000 r and the HP4 are really buggy, <laughs> really. People complain all over the internet, not functioning, not have no idea what, what's wrong with the damn thing. And dealers are just exchange them for new ones without even knowing what the problem is, was. <laughs> so here I got the quick shifter I took apart. So, come on over and we start. Now guys, this is the quick shifter and all its components. Well, not all as I, wait a minute. This is the new, well, new, second hand new quick shifter. And as you can see, there is this black, yeah, plastic thing. Um, actually, you can take it off very carefully. You need to warm it up. And as you can see here, there are those, yeah, ridges. That's in here. So you can pull it off. But what's in the damn thing? I had no idea, no idea whatsoever. But it turns out there is just one tiny print inside. And that thing is a hole sensor. It's specially made to detect magnetism. Remember, in here, as you can see, is this thing, and in there is a magnet. See? It goes in here. Hop. In there. And that magnet, when you push your gear lever, comes in front of that hole sensor. So it detects, hey, he is about to change gears. But only when you don't apply the clutch, um, let's see, and you're in second till the sixth gear. Because in the first gear you always use your clutch and the clutch got two switches uh, so the the computer in the bike knows that you're applying the clutch lever squeezing so, that said you're in second gear revving and you want to change gears without using the clutch so 
with your feet, you move the lever up. This magnet slides in front of that hall sensor and that detects, hey, he is about to change gears. What it does then, it stops the ignition for just a split second. And in that split second, all the forces on your gearbox are gone. So normally all the gears are engaged because you are uh, uh, driving. But the moment your ignition stops functioning, that drive is away. And the gears are not really stuck together and it almost automatically flies into the next gear. Your ignition comes on again and you're in the next gear moving on. So that's how the quick shifter works. What can I tell more? Um, there is this uh, nut over here on this side and it has a red marking and that red marking is very important because that is factory set so don't tinker with it as it has that exact position for the hall sensor to detect that magnet in here, show it over there, see, in here is this uh, plastic holder thing and the magnet with that holder slides into there, see, there are these two rigids and in there you got two slots, slides something and it goes into here only one way see and now because that magnet goes up and down and over here here that black thing so that whole sensor is over there and as you can see that magnet goes from there to there so yep yeah. it goes that side as this spring is over there and this one is over there so the moment you start changing gears, you press also against that spring, that magnet comes in line in front of that hall sensor and then the bike knows that you're about to switch gears. Actually that's all, that's absolutely all. But the problem with the damn thing is is very buggy. Uh, I'm gonna renew this one and this goes through a hole in the frame and BMW mounted the, the quick shifter and each time it moves with each gear change it rubs against the frame. I've seen a lot of them and they all do that. And it's really in time over here you can already see it.
I noticed that already with my son's bike and I unlocked it both sides and gave it just a few mil.